And some people very wrongly call Darwin, Darwin a biologist. Actually, he wasn't trained in biology. He was trained a theolo as a theologian. First, he wanted to study medicine, but then he dropped out because he didn't consider it as a fit, a good choice for him. Then his father went him to the theology school, so he dropped out again, dropped out as well. So he got on a big uh, ship called Beagle. So he was an adventurist. He was not a scientist, no. A biologist so probably he maybe an eighth grade student knows much more than Darwin could have ever known so it's, it's just an adventurist that set off uh, with a ship and what the Darwinists fail to think another thing that fail to think is that the technology has advanced so much since the time of Darwin the science today shows us that the, the world is as an the world is an illusion actually for example the atoms that are building up everything in the universe our bodies everything they understand that the atoms the, this world is actually completely transparent there's no light outside and what is colorful very colorful the science tell us that inside your brain there is a world and that's that part that place is colorful and there is something that sees this world that hears this world that senses touches this world without any senses and what is this when we ask them what is this who is this the science tells us that soul 